Once upon a time, there was a giant, who lived in a forest near a kingdom. He was always tired, so he used to take naps during the day. Nearby there was a farm, where a farmer lived. The farmer used to go for walks into the forest every day. One day, the farmer was walking in the forest as he stumbled upon a branch and fell. Unlucky as he was he fell on the foot of the giant who was sleeping next to the branch. The giant woke up and was angry. Who dares waking me up from my nap? I will eat you now. The giant grabbed the farmer and was about to eat him. The farmer said, Please don't eat me Mr. Giant. I swear it was an accident. If you let me go I promise that I will return the favor in the future. The giant was amused by the farmer's suggestion. How could a little farmer help a big giant? But he found it funny, so he let the farmer go. Thank you Mr. Giant, I will never forget this. Also I will never wake you up from your nap again. A few years passed and a king and his soldiers were passing in the forest. That day, the giant was also taking a nap in the forest, as the king and his soldiers were passing the sleeping giant. The king was horrified. This giant is a threat. Catch him and bring him back to my prison. The soldiers threw a huge net over the giant. The giant woke up and he couldn't move. He was terrified. The soldiers went back to the castle to bring a cart to carry the giant back to the king's prison. While they were gone, the farmer was on his usual walk in the forest. As he saw the giant struggling to get out of the net, he remembered the promise he once made to the giant. He took out his knife and cut the net into pieces. The giant was freed. Thank you so much Mr. Farmer. I'm so grateful that you helped me. I don't know how to thank you. No problem, I owed you one from back in the day. Let's be friends from now on. So the giant and the farmer became friends. As the soldiers came back from the castle with a cart to load the giant in, they saw that their net was torn into pieces. What they found on the ground instead was a tape recorder. They pressed play and this is what they heard. They never returned to the forest ever again. The end. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Cheers. Yeah 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 woo woo. Hubba hubba woo woo.